Nate the Cox, thanks for joining us around the home. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys how to change the head on a Gleam toothbrush, okay? Got these from my kids a while back, and it was way past time for my sons. The head was crushed. I don't have to show you to you, because it's in the trash, but just trust me, the bristles were crushed. And I went to the local store, got the new uh, replacement head, by the way. Amazon links in the description down below for this toothbrush, the replacement heads, all that stuff. We're Amazon affiliates, so it helps support the channel, help support all the stuff we do here, helps us make better videos, more videos. So if you click on that link, costs you nothing, but it helps us. So we totally appreciate it. Let's get straight over to it. Okay, toothbrush here. This is the very simple one that has the AAA battery in it. And, um, right, doesn't matter if it's this color or if it's the peach or the white or whatever. Now I thought you had to like twist it quarter turn and yank it or unscrew it or something. I kept messing with it and it wasn't working. It's really so much simpler than that. Just take it, give it a yank. There you go. Now, if this toothbrush is anything like my son's, I had a bunch of like toothpaste stuck in there, so I took a paper towel and wiped it out real good first. All right, and then I took the new head, line it up so it's in front of the power button, right? And snap back right in. And then you're done. That's it. Okay, so if you want clean teeth and you want this thing to actually help you out to get those cleaner teeth or your kids or whatever, you gotta keep these heads changed out because if they get crushed and all, they all flattened or this and that, it's not doing so good anymore. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope this helped you out. Please subscribe to the channel. Check out our website. Hundreds of more videos organized really, really well. You guys have a great day.